How's it going, my dreamers? This is Born to Dream, back with episode number 12 of the Pokemon Let's Go Eevee Let's Play. Be sure to leave a like down below if you're enjoying the video. Subscribe for more Pokemon Let's Go Eevee content, and be sure to check out the playlist in the description down below if you'd like to see any previous episodes of the Pokemon Let's Go Eevee Let's Play. Um, so, sorry for the... <laughs> I feel like every time I start up these recordings, I'm apologizing for something, and I am sorry for that, but... Sorry for the, like, poor audio quality, uh, in the last few videos. I have my mic, like, over here. I'm not used to having my mic over here, but it was, like, pretty far away from me. Um, it was a little too far away, and I couldn't really fix the audio, uh, once when I saw it in Audacity, so... That's why I was having the issues. The mic is now here. I can literally just kiss the thing. Like, I'm that close to it, so... Should sound a lot better now. Um, not kiss it, but y y you know what I mean. Anyways, here's the team. And of course we got all the moves and I did not heal back, but I don't think I need to. It's alright. Um, yeah, here's the team. We're not going to show moves because we don't do that in this Let's Play. Um, fuck it, I'm going to use some potions. So, anyways, you guys, well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We'll, we'll use the potions in a minute. Okay, you guys see the team, right? Um, Xavier, I'm about ready to evolve. Um, it will, it will evolve in this episode, so we will get a Charizard. Um, it's level 38 because, honestly, it's kind of hard. I mean, I could have put it in the box when it was, like, level 35 and just kept it that way, but it's a few extra levels. It's not that big of a deal. I just want to evolve the Charmeleon on screen because that's a, that's a big evolution. Um, and then we also have... Vulpix, and I'm gonna go ahead and evolve it right now. So let's go ahead and do this. Um, where is it? Let's do this right now. We're gonna get ourselves a Nine Tails. Awesome. Now I did like a ton of. I did a lot of shiny Vulpex hunting, and I did not get a, a shiny Vulpex, but I found a shiny Chansey, and as you guys saw on Twitter, uh, it ran for me. I was hella upset. I was like, there's a green Chansey on my- oh, let me read this. According to an enduring legend, nine noble saints were united and reincarnated as this Pokemon. Oh, okay. That's kind of wild. Um, but yeah, I found a green chancy and it ran for me. That, I, I, I couldn't believe it at first. And then I was like, there's no way I'm catching this. And I didn't. So, maybe I should have been a little more positive, but... Oh, where's the Ninetales? Hold up. It's following me, right? Yeah, it's following me. Darn. Okay, well, we'll see the Ninetales in a minute. Um... Where's my where's my medicine? Okay, let me use this po these potions real quick. Let me use these potions, and um, then we'll take on Giovanni. We'll mess him up, I guess. I don't know. Should go way better than it did with Archer. I'm also gonna wait. Hold on. Before I do that, I'm gonna put Loner. Wait. Yeah, I'm gonna put Loner in the front. Let's do it. Let's do it, let's do it. I was, I was thinking maybe I should put Gyarados in the front, but eh. Alright, Giovanni's voice. So, you defeated Archer. I must say, I am impressed you got here. Team Rocket captures Pokemon from around the world. They are important tools for keeping our criminal enterprise going. And I am the leader of this enterprise, Giovanni. What? You want me to release the Cubone? Ma ma ma. 
You came barging into our hideout just for that? What an amusing child. But for your insolence, you will feel a world of pain. Alright, bro. Oh, shit. This doesn't feel as epic without the music, man. It's just a regular... It's just a regular, um... Gen 1 music. Why does he only have two Pokemon? That's, like, weird. So he starts out with this Persian. Okay. And you go for Fake Out. That's fantastic. Let me get a Leech Seed off real quick. Real quick, real quick, real quick. Sweet! So what's the next mod? Is it gonna be a Kangaskhan? I'm expecting the Kangaskhan. So I figure that's what it's gonna be. It's gonna be a Kangaskhan. But he, he would have to have a ground type, right? He is a ground type leader, so it makes sense. It makes sense. You know what? You, you know what I wish they kind of should have done? I wish they gave him a lull inversion just for the... <laughs> because he was he was in the Alolan region. Well, he's not in the Alolan... He hasn't made it to Alola yet. So, maybe not. But I, I still would have thought it would have been cool if they gave him a lull inversion. This is just for shits and giggles. Alright, so... Um... Next up is Rhyhorn. Oh, okay. Figured it had to be a ground type, so he doesn't have the Kangaskhan. Huh. Let me get this uh, Razor Leaf off real quick. Sweet! Good shit, Venusaur. He wasn't that bad. He was not that bad. You beat Team Rocket boss Giovanni. What? It can't. This can't be. So, I am, I too am defeated by a child. Switch. Thank you. And at, do you, as you wish, with that Cubone. Hold on, let me do this. I forgot to do this. Ah! Hold on. Hold on. There, it'll be better. Ma! And take this as my apology for mocking you as a child. The self-scope. Yes. Alright. I can see you raise Pokemon with utmost care, but you would never understand what I hope to achieve. I shall step aside this time. But I hope we will meet and battle again. This Cubone's so happy. Cubone head back to Lavender Town. Maybe with the so maybe with the Soscope you'll be able to find out the identity of that ghost. Cubone seem seems to have gone home on its own. Why don't you go out, get out of here too, and try to figure out how to use that Soscope or something? I mean, you got you guys really couldn't figure that one out. Okay. Well, let's go ahead. We can go to the first floor. And uh, let's head towards Lavender Town. We could take on Erica right now too, but no, nah, we'll, we'll go to Lavender first. We can save Erica for the next one. Let's do it. I do want to get to Future City because I want to. Well, I do want to transfer some Pokemon into Let's Go. Um. Oh, here it is! Look at the Nine Tails. Oh shit. I hate when it does this. I just want to talk to the Ninetales. Poked at your legs. The fuck? Okay. Dude, look at this thing. It's so freaking gorgeous. It's so gorgeous, dude. It's so cool. Alright. Well. Oh! Before, uh, before I move any further, I figured out where to find a Porygon. Wait for it. It's here. See? Right there. You can actually get Porygon here. And actually, I'm going to take a little, like, break. Because I'm still looking for the shiny Vulpex. <laughs> oh, shit. There's a Gadabra here. Where's the Vulpex? 
Oh my god, okay. <laughs> I don't even get one Vulpex to spawn. Oh, by the way, I already did this. I, I, I did it because I was trying to get back and forth to um, Celadon and Vermilion. So I could, so, you know, I could shiny hunt. Um, so I already did all that. I think you guys know what happens anyways. You give the person the tea, he gulps it all up, and then you can move on. It's, it's not like... <laughs> Nothing really happens. There's no big cutscenes or anything like that. So I figured, and there's nothing that goes on in Saffron until you take on Silphco, anyways. So, um, I'm taking a, I'm still taking a little break. <laughs> I really want this shiny Vulpex, dude. Oh shit! 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 I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. Hey guys, look at my nine tails. Any want any of you want to turn shiny for me? I feel like if I if I got the nine tails, then a shiny Volpex would show up <laughs> because it'd be the greatest inconvenience. Because I I already used my Firestone. It's all right. See that was my thing. Okay, so Pokemon Go story time. So I was at a Magikarp nest, right? And this was during the Mew Mew. Uh, Special research when it first came out, and I was doing the Magikarp quest. We all know about that, right? We gotta evolve a Magikarp into Gyarados. You have to spend 400 candies. So, anyways, um, ah, oh, well, more story. Um, I went to a Magikarp nest, right? And uh, I, I, I got enough candy to evolve a Magikarp into a Gyarados. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna evolve a Magikarp and leave. And then I did that, and then I was like, you know what, let's go around the block one more time. Magikarps don't spawn here every day, right? So I'm just going to walk around the block one more time, and we'll get a few more Magikarps. And then I got halfway through the loop, and a fucking shiny, this was like the first Magikarp I found. It was fucking shiny. And I was like, ah, I just evolved a regular Magikarp. It was my first shiny too, and I was just like, I had to get another 400 candies. But thankfully they did like a Magikarp event like not too long after that, and I got a red Gyarados. And it's maxed out now, but still, that was some bull. That was some major bull, dude. <sighs> that, that, that's the kind of thinking I thought would happen with uh, the Vulpex here. I thought something like that would happen. Hasn't happened yet, though. There's a big fat Chansey. Alright. One Vulpex. Two Vulpex. I know there's more to spawn. Okay, that's it. Damn it! It's really been a struggle, man. I swear. It's been a struggle. It's been a real big struggle. I'm at, like, 44 caught Vulpex, but, like, I've, I've spent way more hours sitting, staring at the Switch screen, and waiting for a shiny to pop up. It's been, it's been, uh, it's been an annoying past few days, I guess. Oh, what the hell? Did Trevor get a new, new girlfriend? Uh, so, that's Kibo's mom. That's right. Team Rocket keeps on keeps on going after Marowak so it can sell those skulls they wear for profit. I think Cubo is still looking for its mother, even though she's gone. I just can't forgive that Team Rocket. Me neither. I saw Cubo heading into the tower a little while ago too. I'll go look for it, and I'll keep an eye out for that Mr. Fuji too, the one who's been missing. Thank you, and be careful. I really don't like ghosts, but I've got to do this. Ah, Dreamer. Nice timing. You got most of that, right? What'd you say? You want to come with me? Sure. Thanks, pal. It'll be a big relief to have you. I'll just let you lead the way, okay? Um, okay. Hang on. I don't know if I healed. Did I heal? No, I didn't heal. Okay, hold up. Hold on, Trevor. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. 
be right back. Let me go ahead and heal up real quick. And we'll take on Lavender. I'm like, so, I'm trying not to catch any Pokemon at the moment, because I'm going to keep my Vulpex streak. Um, I don't think that's going to, I don't think that's going to last, because we do have to deal with the Snorlax. So, that's a thing. So, I don't know how long I'm going to be able to keep the streak up, but, whatever. But that's just, that's just me saying that I'm not going to try to catch any Ghastly or Haunters right now. Unless I get a Shiny, then that would be freaking amazing. But I'm not going to I'm not gonna catch any right now. Because I do want a Ga Ghastly or Haunter. Just not right this second. Urgh. Do, do you think there really are ghosts in here? Huh? Dreamer, what's that? The self scope revealed the ghost's true form. Ooh. Whoa! That's crazy, so those ghosts were actually Pokemon? Yes, there's such a thing as ghost Pokemon. Oh, I was kind of hoping to run into that Haunter. Okay, well, shit. Um... I'm just gonna leave the... There's Chansey's in here, too. I'm just gonna leave the Ninetales behind. I was wondering what the rare would be. It's still Chansey? Oh, by the way, Rock Tunnel does have a uh, Kangaskhan. Figured I'd say that too. Because I, I ran in there and there was a Kangaskhan there, so. I feel like I'm spoiling a lot for you guys, but it's whatever. <sighs> maybe you guys do want to know. Maybe you guys maybe you guys do want to know. Maybe you don't feel like looking it up on Cerebi. I don't know. Oh, Jesus Christ, there's a gold, there's a gold bat here. Um, I don't remember Zubats spawning here. Or Golbats. See ya, bro. Oh, jeez. Hello. Damn it. Well, I had to battle somebody. Ghost, no, qua! Qua! <laughs> Chandler, oh my god, she looks terrifying. Jesus Christ. She looks fucking terrifying. Oh, I should not have Venusaur in the front. That's a bad idea. That's a really bad idea. Um, I'm gonna go into Gar- Wait, 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 what level is this Ghastly? I'm going to Kadabra. Hell yeah, I'm going into, uh, Kadabra. Oh, Kadabra actually gets substitute by level up. I was like, the fuck? Yeah, this thing actually has substitute, it's wild. That is absolutely wild. Sucker punch me. You have no attack. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. How would a ghastly sucker punch you? Does it just grow fist out of thin air? I mean, it's a ghost type, so I guess. It's kind of weird. I wish there was a ghastly that went for sucker punch in the anime. Just to see what it'll look like, you know? See what it looks like. All right, where's the ghost? Does she like instantly get cured when I beat her? That's some bullshit, bro. That's some bullshit. Nine tails, you gotta keep up. I haven't seen a single ghastly or haunter yet. I've just seen that Chansey there. Can I not find one? You're really weird if I couldn't. Whatever. Sup? Join us. I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. You, you people are creepy enough. I'm I'm fine. She has a haunt. Oh, I forgot. I still have Venusaur in the front. Darn it. All right, let me go into. Uh, let me go into Hangry. He's got bite. You have nightshade. Ooh. I mean, you are a haunter, so that's probably that's probably your best move. Doses. All right. 
When am I getting my Charizard, dude? That's what I want to know. What a nightmare. Why are they giving me Pokeballs? The fuck? People should be giving me Great Balls. Um, I'm gonna put you in the front. Because you have Bite. Yeah, when am I getting my Charizard? That's what I want to know. When's the Charizard coming? Ah! Not for a little while. Darn. I got a nugget! Yay! <laughs> Nightails is just trying to get to me. Oh, there's a Cubone. Interesting. And your Pokemon are fully healed. Thanks. I almost... I'll run into you. I want to get the item. I want to get the item. So I'll take you on. How many Pokemon you got? You got four? Damn, you have more than Giovanni! <laughs> you really have more than Giovanni, that's wild. Okay. Um, are they all gonna be Ghastlies? That's gonna be kind of boring. Let me go for the Dragon Tail. Oh, wait. Oh, no, no, no. Shit. I should have done that. <laughs> that was stupid of me. Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh, did I really just miss the Dragon Tail? I can just take this thing out with a bite. What am I doing going for Dragon Tail? Just trying to be him, bro. <laughs> God. What if one of these people had a Gengar? That'd be wild, huh? Ugh. I hate that I did that to my Gyarados, because that's what's going to be kind of carrying me for a little bit. Sucker Punch. Ow. Well, you know what? She might actually help me get my Charizard. Oh, maybe not. These Ghastlies aren't really giving that much experience. Darn! So you have another Ghastly. Let me go for the Bites. Okay. I'm gonna take a lot of toxic damage. Cool. Let me get this uh, last bite off. Of course you go for Sucker Punch. Why wouldn't you? Alright. Good stuff. Whoa! Woo! I got a nice stone. Yo, let me get a freaking. Oh, there's a ghastly. I was waiting for that. We got to this far into the uh, Pokemon Tower, and that's the first ghost we've actually seen in the wild. Thank you. I was gonna say, would it... I wonder if the ghastly would just start chasing me if it saw me? Be wild, huh? Alright, let me, uh, let me take you on real quick. She said words that I can't say. Chandler Jennifer. I wonder how long, like, these people have been in this state. Like, they've had to be in this tower for years, right? If I'm literally the first person to beat them... They've had to be here for a while. <laughs> I don't know. Key! She found a key. Um, let me grab this real quick. Three Ultra Balls! Hell yeah, that's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I need in my life. I need them Ultra Balls. And Hyper Potions. That's what I really need. What the hell? Be gone! Be gone, intruders! Oh shit! 
<laughs> what the fuck? Yeah! This one's even bigger than the last one! Dreamer, use the thing! The thing you used last time! <clears throat> okay, this is a little too epic. Oh, there's the mirror whack. Oh my god, this is so sad. That's so sad. This Cubone's just been looking for his mom the entire time, and he, Cubone sees it, and then she disappears. That's so sad. The true form of the ghost was the restless spirit of Cubone's mother. The mother's spirit was calm, returning to its kind and gentle nature. It departed to the afterlife and disappeared. Cubone, you... You just came here because you wanted to see your mom again, huh? Sorry for thinking your mom was scary, Cubone. <laughs> Dreamer, I... I don't want to leave Cubone alone like this. I'm gonna go take it home. Oh, if there's someone named Fuji upstairs, do you think you could see him home too? You sure you're... You sure you're okay by yourself? I'll, I'll be fine. I'm with Cubone now, after all. You've gotten pretty gutsy, haven't you, Dreamer? What? You rescued Cubone from Team Rocket. Where did you go and get that strong? Right, well, then, guess I'll leave this up to you, Dreamer. Come on, Cubone. That's so sad. I mean, I always knew the story, but, like, they actually brought, like, the Cubone into the story this time instead of just, like, you just know, like, you know that Marowak is, like, the mother of a Cubone. You don't know it's, like, the mother of that Cubone. They add a little more significance to it this time around. <laughs> Stop right there. We'll be going first. <laughs> With that specter out of the way, we can finally get to the top. <laughs> You're the old... Geezer, they call him Mr. Fuji, right? You're going to rep be repeating your Pokemon research for the glory of Team Rocket. Ignoring us all, all you like. We're used to it. We won't take no for an answer. You'll help the boss whether you want to or not. Gramps thinks he, he, Gramps here thinks he can resist, so we're saying him straight. You better disappear, Twerp, or be prepared to fight. Bring it on, bitch. Bring it on, bitch. Let's go. So you got Arbok and you got Weezing. All right. Let me go ahead and I'm going to go for the Waterfall on the Weezing. And then Charmeleon, you're gonna go ahead and go for the Dragon Rage on Weezing. Okay, wait, this Charmeleon still has Ember. When the hell does it learn a fire move? Like, when does it learn Fire Blast? Slush Bomb! Okay. Ouch. Let me go for that Waterfall again. And I think we'll go for another Dragon Rage on the Arbok. Good shit. Good shit. Eevee's level 41. Okay. Oh my god, don't poison me! Alright. 
Can a waterfall take this thing out, please? Because I'd like to get this Charizard already. Just take it out, please. By the way, waterfall looks dope. It, I, I just want to say, it just goes to a completely different terrain and then just like clobbers the Pokemon. I think it looks cool. Xavier grew to level 30, 39. Xavier wants to learn Slash. Um, yeah, sure, why not? No, I don't. I'm not gonna use Slash or Smoke Screen, but I'm not gonna use Smoke Screen, so whatever. I don't really care. All right. <laughs> what you want? <laughs> You'll regret this. Why do they give you so much money? They never had that much money in the anime. All right, here we go. We got the Charizard. Very nice. You know what's nice about this Charizard? I'll be able to fly around the region now. Get to move a little faster. Your Xavier evolved into Charizard. Awesome. And here's a Dex entry. When this Pokemon expels a blast of super hot fire, the red flame at the tip of its tail burns more intensely. Wing attack. Okay, sure. I'll get rid of Slash. One, two, and ta-da. Sweet. Alright. By the way, I know I didn't get the Squirtle. I know I didn't get the Squirtle. I'm not gonna have Blastoise on my team, so that's why I didn't get it. <laughs> uh, seriously, again? <laughs> Looks like Operation Stealthy Kidnapped Fuji is a bust then. Don't you think I know? Don't you think I know that? It'll be fine. We'll just have to help out with the takeover of Self Co and Self Saffron City. Looks like Team Rocket's blasting off again. Okay. Oh, who might you be? You came to save me from Team Rocket. Thanks, but I didn't even notice they were here. I was too busy trying to call him the script of Mirwak. I think Mirwak's spirit has finally left us. I must thank you for your kind concern. Follow me to my home. It's the Pokemon house at the foot of this tower. Oh, okay. I was going to say, we have to walk all the way down. So, Dreamer, your Pokedex quest is the one that requires strong dedication. Without deep love for Pokemon, it will be hard to complete such a task. I'm not sure if this will help you, but I'd like you to have it. Alright, we're going to be able to wake up Snorlax now. Upon hearing the Poke Flute, sleeping Pokemon will spring awake. Try using it if you ever find a sleeping Pokemon. Well, thank you, sir. I will gladly take the Poke Flute. And I think what I'm going to go ahead and do is I want to go ahead and end the episode off here. So, i like to thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. In the next episode, we are going to head back to Celadon City and we are going to take on Erica. So, I will see you guys then. Keep living the dream. Goodbye.